General Staff has issued the following communique, number one, at 6.15 p.m. On the 1st of September 1939, at dawn, the Germans crossed into our territory. German Air Force and regular army unexpectedly invaded Polish territory without a declaration of hostilities. In the early morning, the German airplanes attacked a number of towns all over Poland. The German airmen have bombed. Augustuk, Novichburg, Ostruk, Mazowiecki, Brodnica, Czech, Puk, Zambów, Radomsko, Toruń, Kutno, Tunel, Kraków, Krosno, Trzebinia, Gdynia, Jasło, Tomaszów, Mazowiecki, Katowice, Grodno. Casualties have been reported among the civilian population. Near Kutno, the Germans have both machine gunned and bombed an evacuation train. In Grodno, a Catholic church was damaged. At Biarapodnaska, a Greek Orthodox church was partly destroyed. Further bombings are taking place. In the region of Danzig, the German Air Force attacks Gdynia, bombing it heavily. The enemy Air Force consists of 16 airplanes which have been brought down today. Poland has lost two units. Simultaneously with air attacks, German troops have violated Polish territory, crossing the border in several places. Fighting is going on in the frontier region. The heaviest fighting is reported from the Silesian sector. Up to now, Polish artillery has destroyed the German armored train, thus taking prisoners. Several tanks have been put out of action. In Danzig, three German attacks against Vesper Plateau have been repelled. In reply to Polish protest yesterday against the military occupation of Slovakia, Monsieur Schatzmarie, the Slovak minister in Warsaw, presented the following statement in appeal to Colonel Beck, the Polish foreign minister, this morning. In the name of the Slovak nation and of its representatives, who under the pressure of the Third Reich are forced to silence and used for intrigues in the exclusive interest of Germany, I, as the representative of the Slovak state in the Republic of Poland, protest against the brutal disarmament of the Slovak army against the willful occupation of Slovakia by the armies of the Third Reich, and finally against the using of Slovakia for military operations directed against the brotherly Polish nations.